Well, hello. All right. Rig Zap here, Chef Rig Zap. And I'm not wearing my towel yet because I've got this piece of dragon fruit on the towel. Have you ever seen one of these in the store? It's got some great colors to it. So let's uh, let's get busy here. I've never I've heard of them. Don't recall really ever seeing one. I got this at one of our local year-round farmers markets. They import fruits from all around the world, all during the year. So you can have lots of opportunities to find some interesting uh, fruit. So it's, looking it up, it's native to Central America and Mexico. Bright orange, bright red skin with, uh, you know, leaves and all. That's why they call it a dragon fruit. It's supposed to look like a dragon. Me? I'm not too sure. This is the first time. Now, this is first time, and this is not faked or anything here. Got a good sharp knife, and we're just going to cut it in, it's supposed to either be white flesh, or yellow, or maybe sometimes red. Let's see what color this one is, and we're going to see how hard it is to cut, too. Oh, easy, easy, easy peasy, yeah, I'm surprised. Okay, this is kind of a dark white. I believe it's fresh, uh, it's ripe because, you know, it's kind of soft, gives, that's the quality of it. I'm going to set that aside. Let's take off. Let's make a slice here. Let's just set this aside on my paper towel here. I'm going to Just cut some, oh, it cuts the, the flesh, cuts real easy. It's supposed to have a taste between a kiwi and a pear and a watermelon. Let's just take a, take a taste right here. Almost live, but unedited. Yeah, I could see that. Maybe, if I think about it. Maybe it's got the consistency of a, of a pear. Hmm. Not sure what else. It, <laughs> to me, it kind of likes you're eating... Tastes like you're eating the grass outside in the yard. <laughs> Not that I do that all the time, but that's uh, you know you could you could figure. Hmm. Yeah, that's about it. Different things you can do with it. You can dice it up, put it in a salad. You can make a smoothie out of it, add banana, pineapple into a blender, make a smoothie out of it, a little protein powder. But look them up online, Google it. Google dragon fruit. It's got lots of good health qualities, fiber, vitamin C, antioxidants, all kinds of fun stuff, B vitamins, it's small amounts, but hey, it's not bad. I think uh, I'm going to dig up some other fruits here and see what I can mix it with or make a smoothie. Who knows? Peace, love, and vanilla candles. Rick, Chef Rick Zep, and his dragon fruit. Out.